Hey guys, Wrestling Rambles 89 here again with yet another reaction video. Just a very short one this time, but the topic is interesting, so I wanted to react. This is Stan Cole talking about why he turned down offers to wrestle Hulk Hogan multiple times. Should be interesting, so let's see what Steve has to say about us here. Here's one from Abdullah. He says, Dear Steve, the damn dirt sheets report that you turned down a match with Hogan in 2002, 2004, and 2005 again. Could you set the record straight once and for all? Let, let me see. When it came down to turning down a Hogan match in 02, 04, and 05, yeah, yeah I believe I did turn them all down that time cool because, stuff. you know, I just never figured it was going to be that great of a matchup. I thought our Agreed. styles were so contrasting, you know. I, you know, I could have done it for the money, and yeah, no, would have been a ton of that money. would have been fine. I could have put the money in the bank and paid Uncle yeah. Sam his percentage. But uh, my head wasn't in the space that I thought we could execute what I think yeah, we need to execute. So, well. you know, I'd rather not do, do something that I'm not 100% about, and I wasn't 100% about that Very matchup. Place, no disrespect to Hulk Hogan, one of the greatest superstars that ever got in the squared circle. Agreed. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. Okay, so that was really level-headed, really smart, and really honest from Austin. I know he has a tendency to dance around some subjects or give a non-committal answer, but what he said makes perfect sense, and I agree with it 100%. Stone Cold style honestly would clash quite badly with Hogan. Austin was burnt out, he's brought up many times psychologically, and Hulk Hogan, even then, his body was in pretty bad shape. I mean... I actually think it was much better if he got to wrestle The Rock instead of Stone Cold, even though it's the classic dream match kind of thing. It's still like 1A and 1B when it comes to Rock and Austin, depending on which person it is. You might think The Rock's 1A and vice versa. But regardless, The Rock had that kind of natural Hollywood appeal, Hollywood charm, whatever you want to call it, the same as Hogan. So their styles work much better. Especially since Austin was the brawler, kick-ass type, whereas Rock relied a lot more on shelly, flashy stuff and charisma and trying to make it more entertaining, per se, whereas Austin was all about just kicking ass and realism. So I think Austin made the right choice. He would have made a ton of money, but the fact he had the integrity to turn down who knows how many millions of dollars just because he thought it would be a good match, Massive respect to Austin for that. Fair play to him. And that was really good and interesting to listen to. I hope you enjoyed it, Tim. Thank you for watching as always. Like, subscribe, and click the notifications bell if you haven't already. This is Wrestling Rambles 89, signing off.